Hello, my friends. Welcome back. It is still Wednesday, September 20th, 2023. I'm the Drunk Folk Group Tis Beer Time. Are you shook? Have you been bone shook? Bone Shaker has been part of everything I've done since the very beginning. It was one of the very first IPAs that I ever liked. It kind of crossed me over, if you want to say that. And they put out swag sometimes. So we have the crystal mug. We have last year's gigantic sort of coffee skull mug. And this year's in the category of, do I need it? No. Am I going to get it because I want it? Yes. Is the Bone Shaker Unfiltered Pale Ale Bobblehead. Don't take it out of the packaging. It'll lose all of its value. And I'm like, it's mine. I'm going to play with it. Break the bobblehead already. Look at it. Look at it. Look at the bobbles. So... So I saw it, I was picking up some Irish cream or whiskey or something, and I saw it the other week. Sorry. I thought to myself, I, I kind of want it. So you buy two six-packs, Bone Shaker, and it's free. You just, just boo -hoo -hoo. And then you get to drink Bone Shaker. So Bone Shaker is one of those West Coast IPAs that it's a little different than Lone Pine, uh, Headstock, and even to a degree, Mad Tom. Am I going to drink out of the giant skull mug? Of course I am, because guess what? That means I get to have two beers. That's trivia and i got to have two beers. So I love these giveaways. I mean, there's not a lot of swag in craft beer. There never has been when it comes to, like, you know, free stuff. It's not really free. I bought two cases of beer. But uh, <laughs> I'm a sucker. I, I'm a folks like, why did you get that? What is the purpose of that to you? And I'm like, yeah, I own it now. It's mine. I got it. My precious. <laughs> Let's get into the beer. Cheers. So one thing about Bone Shaker, it is the most malt-forward, traditional style, core West Coast IPA in Ontario. And I honestly think it's gotten better in the last couple of years. I am of the mind that the last couple of times I've had Bone Shaker, I've been like, mmm, like this is piney and grapefruit pith. And we're back. What happened? My phone fell over. <laughs> I, I don't know. Listen, my phone set up. I don't have like a ring light or anything. My phone leans up against a, 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 like an oil container on top of a book. I'll put a picture at the end. You can take a look at my filming method if you want. But uh, we're talking about taste of bone shaker. Listen, this is a big, malty, hoppy, aggressively hopped beer. I friggin' love it. It introduced me to that side of the world. I think because it was maltier than... Most of the other IPAs, it identified like with the English IPAs I was drinking, and it kind of took me from there. I love this nonsense. I love getting swag. I love getting these big skull mugs, right? I love getting this skull mug. I love having a bobblehead. Do I need it? Absolutely not. Do I want it? I do. And you know what? For the price of what? Buying 12 beers, I can get a bobblehead? I'm going to buy 12 beers anyways. Might as well get something out of it, right? All right, my friends, listen. <sighs> Like my buddy, the brewhead, used to say, I got a bone shaker. Bobblehead. <laughs> and pick it up at your local LCBO. They don't have it. Then make them bring it in. Anyways, try not to have my phone fall over anymore, but uh, that's life. You know, it's a beautiful time to be alive. We got these kind of nonsense things. And I'm not, I'm not making fun of them by calling them nonsense. Listen, nobody, it, it's just, it's fun to have. Like, I like having this mug. When I have my bone shakers, I get like a four-pack or six-pack of bone shakers. Grab this mug. That's three beers. Three beers. Because that's six beers. going to be three beers. If you say it's really just one beer because I'm never going to let this go empty. So, drunk math, right? Polk loves you. Pick it up if you want it. If you're a bone shaker fan, get your bone shook. Amsterdam. Cheers. I love Wednesdays. It's my Thursday, so it's basically the weekend, so... Pull me another one. Let's go. 